Well, we are back for week four already of Friday Night Lights. Can't believe that. We've made it to district play now. They really count as Wes hosts Whitney for a fun 7-3A showdown. Six News sports reporter Nicole Sheeran is live with us at Trojan Stadium in the Kalachi Kingdom of Texas. Nicole, looks like you're all ready for an interview to talk about tonight's game. Tell us about it. Hey Chris, I'm here at the home of the Trojans as Wes takes on Whitney for his first district game of the season. Joining me now is Trojans head coach David Woodard. So coach, tonight marks your first district game of the year. How are you feeling? You know, it's it's a little bit different. You know, we it, we usually don't play district games this early, and you know, only having two non-district games under your belt to prepare for tonight, uh, you know, is a little bit different. But uh, you know, our, our kids have had a good last couple of weeks. You know, being being open last week, and uh, you know, looking forward to getting this thing rolling. And you're coming off of a 21 to 15 loss to Lorena last Friday. So how are you hoping to bounce back tonight? You know, I think the biggest thing is, you know, we had the, we had the open week right through there and we were able to come in and fix some of the mistakes we made. And, you know, the good teams like that, they, they expose some things that you need to really work on. And so we spent some time working on the, our weaknesses and some things that we needed to get better at. And so, uh, you know, hopefully that, that extra work we had and, and the, you know, the way they uh, kind of expose some things with us, it'll really help us out as we get moving into district. Now you lost 13 starters to a season where your squad made it all the way to the regional finals, but a key player in TJ McCutcheon returns for this squad. So how are you hoping to carry over that momentum this year? You know, we, we do. We, we've, got a, we've got a good group of kids coming back. Uh, you know, a lot, of, a lot of guys that were a part of that group, uh, you know, a lot of them didn't get a lot of experience, but, you know, they were there and know what it takes to be able to, you know, to be successful and to, and to have to play at that level. And so, uh, you know, TJ's one of those guys that's got a lot of snaps under his belt. And, uh, you know, we look for him to be one of those guys that leads us and, and, and puts us on his shoulders and, and carries us to where we can go. And Whitney sits at 1-0 in district so far. What's the key to beating the Wildcats tonight? I mean, we got to play fundamentally sound. You know, all, defensively, we get, they play really fast and, and offensively, and we got to get lined up defensively. And then, you know, offensively, we got to control the clock and, and uh, you know, try, try our best to keep those dudes off the field. And so, uh, you know, it's about us doing everything right tonight. And, uh, you know, hopefully, you know, we do that, we give ourselves a chance. Well, Coach, thank you so much. District gate play is finally here, and it is definitely going to be an exciting matchup. 7.30 kick. We will have highlights for you at 10 on Friday Night Lights. But, you know, I have about an hour until kickoff, so I think i got to try one of those famous kolaches while I'm in town. Back to you, Chris.